Hi, I'm Rodell, and I'm an advisor here at Crutchfield, and I'm here to talk to you today about the Blue Sound Node. The Blue Sound Node is a network music streaming device that gives you all sorts of connectivity, versatility, and ease of use, and will connect to an existing amplifier in your stereo system. So what does that mean? Say you have an existing amplifier receiver that doesn't have any digital inputs or a set of favorite powered speakers that don't have any wireless connectivity. The Blue Sound node will allow you to attach to those existing devices and give you all sorts of functionality. So the advantage of a network music streamer over say like built-in Bluetooth to your receiver is that the network streamer will also allow you to connect via Wi-Fi, which gives you access to high res files in a way that you simply don't have with Bluetooth. That means you can connect to your home PC uh, for FLAC files or lossless files you have stored on your home network. It also means that you can stream from high-res music streaming services like Tidal, Kobuz, or Apple Music Lossless to make sure you're getting the most out of your music and your existing stereo system in a way that Bluetooth can't just do quite yet. To get connected to your network, you have two options. You can use the node's built-in Wi-Fi to connect wirelessly to your existing home system, or if you prefer a hardwired connection, there is an ethernet port on the back of the Blue Sound node. In addition to network connectivity, we also do have an HDMI enhanced audio return channel port, which means that you can connect your TV to the Blue Sound node, and with that eARC port, that means your smart TV will be able to stream audio back to the node to give you full performance and quality sound. If HDMI isn't the connection for you, we do also have a digital optical input as well as an analog input combo. And now it will come with the adapter that you need for that digital optical to analog input mini jack on the back. And so you will be in the clear for all of your audio input needs. To connect to your amplifier, the Blue Sound node has a set of RCA outs as well as a subwoofer output to allow you to connect your powered subwoofer to the Blue Sound node. In addition to those analog outputs, we do have a coaxial digital and a digital optical output to uh, uh, connect an external DAC to make sure you're getting the best resolution from your high-res music files. In addition to those connections, there is a three and a half millimeter headphone jack on the front, so you can connect a set of wired headphones. If you prefer Bluetooth headphones, the Blue Sound node does have two-way Aptex HD Bluetooth connections, which means that you can actually stream to your favorite Bluetooth headphones or a pair of Bluetooth speakers. To round out the connections on the back of the Blue Sound node, we do have a USB-A type input to allow you to connect a flash drive or external hard drive. Now, that's not for connecting an Apple or Android phone, it is just for music storage. In addition to that, we have a 12 volt trigger as well as an IR input sensor as well, which of course allows you to integrate with your existing system and keep that convenience. And finally, we do have a detachable power cord as well. So the Blue Sound node has all of that connectivity and functionality just by adding this device to your existing amplifier. In addition to that, Blue Sound also acts as a gateway into Blue Sound's proprietary Blue OS system, which is Blue Sound's approach to multi-room audio. Uh, where Blue Sound differs from some other companies that are in the multi-room audio game as well is Blue Sound's commitment to high-res playback. Uh, that means that this thing has an upgraded 32-bit, 384 kilohertz DAC. Uh, it means that it has MQA support because Blue Sound really wants to stay committed to letting you enjoy and get the most out of your high-res music files. That means that you can control all of your Blue OS uh, devices from a single device, and that means, of course, synchronized audio playback in different rooms throughout your house, or even different sources playing at the same time throughout your house, all from one point of control. In addition to the app, uh, there is a motion sense activated touch panel on the top of the device that allows you to adjust volume, play pause, and even has five presets uh, so that you can set up your favorite internet radio station or streaming platform to play with just the click of a button. In addition to that, the Blue Sound node is also compatible with your smart home, whether it be Amazon Alexa or Google Assistant, which gives you voice activation control over the Blue Sound node. One thing that really stood out to me about the Blue OS app was how easy it was to set up. Uh, from start to finish, it took me less than five minutes to get the node connected to my home Wi-Fi network and start enjoying music. I wanted to put the Blue Sound through the ringer, uh, so I used a couple different streaming platforms. 
Tidal, Cobuzz, and the new lossless format from Apple Music and had it connected to a set of powered speakers on my work desk. Uh, downstairs, I have an NAD desktop amplifier that I connected it to. And I also tried connecting a set of Sennheiser headphones to the front panel jack, as well as a set of Sennheiser True Momentum 2s uh, to see how the Aptex HD Bluetooth performed. In all of those cases, I was impressed immediately by how easy it was to navigate the apps and connect everything, and also how uh, the 32-bit 384 kilohertz DAC made my music sound richer, fuller, and I was especially struck by, on Tidal and Apple Music, how much wider the dynamic range was on all of the gear I connected it to. So if you're looking to add some modern functionality to your existing receiver, or you're hoping to build out a secondary system with some multi-room audio capability, maybe the Blue Sound Note is perfect for you. If you have any questions about network music streamers or any other home audio components, don't hesitate to chat us online or give us a call here at Crutchfield. Thanks for watching.